हेलो एवरी वन टूडे वी विल टॉक अबाउट द डिजीज कॉल द मिथाइल मेलॉनिक एसिडीमिया एज द नेम इंडिकेट्स इट विल हैव समथिंग टू डू विद द मिथाइल मेलॉनिक एसिड द मेटाबॉलिज्म ऑफ मेनली थ्री अमीनो एसिड द आइसोलियोसिन द वेलिन एंड मैथियोनिन द मेटाबॉलिक मेटाबॉलिज्म ऑफ मेनली दीज अमीनो एसिड्स एंड सम अदर्स लेट टू द अल्टीमेटली टू द फॉर्मेशन ऑफ अ कंपाउंड विच इज कॉल द मिथाइल मेलोनाइल को एंजाइम ए देन दिस मिथाइल मेलोनाइल को एंजाइम ए नॉर्मली इट इज कन्वर्टिड इन टू अ सक्सिनाइल को एंजाइम ए बाय एन एंजाइम विच इज कॉल दी मिथाइल मेलोनाइल को एंजाइम ए म्यूटेस and this is the reaction which uh, employs vitamin b12 this is one of the two reactions occurring in the human body that that is that is using the vitamin b12 it will use the methyl cobalamin form of vitamin b12 okay now when this reaction is stopped either to, due to the deficiency of the uh, deficiency of the vitamin b12 in the body or due to the deficiency of the methyl melonic uh, melonyl coenzyme a mutase enzyme the methyl melonic acid will start accumulating and it will lead to the effects of the methyl melonic acidemia so first of all the um, uh, body tissues will have a great concentration of methyl melonic acid and it can be measured in urine the second manifestation will that this methyl melonic acid will cause the metabolic acidosis this is obvious that because this is obvious because the uh, methyl melonic acid is a uh, methyl melonic acid is a you can say acidic compound okay now the second and third manifestation of this methyl melonic acidemia is that the uh, there will be the developmental disability now why is there developmental disability basically the uh, the amino acids isoleucine and valine these are the branch chain amino acids and uh, their metabolism produces because their metabolism produces methyl melonyl coenzyme a when there is deficiency of either b12 or methyl melonic the methyl melonyl coenzyme a mutase enzyme these amino acids will start branch chain amino acids will start accumulating in the body fluids uh, uh, sorry not in the body fluids but in the tissues specifically the central nervous system tissues and it will lead to the mental retardation and developmental disability and same is the case with the uh, metabolism of the b12 uh, sorry the same is the case with the deficiency of the b12 when there is a deficiency of the b12 either due to deficiency in the diet or due to the deficiency of the intrinsic factor uh, due to some uh, gastric ulcer disease or pernicious anemia which is also called uh, there will be the uh, there will be manifestation of the methyl melonic acidemia with metabolic acidosis uh, and developmental disability including the peripheral neuropathy now let's talk about the cystinuria okay this cystinuria as the name indicates is will be the uh, disease in which the cysteine amino acid will be present in urine now why will the cysteine amino acid present in urine as you know that the renal tubule renal tubular cells in the proximal tubule proximal tubule of the kidney absorb the amino acid along with the sodium sodium uh, by the process of the secondary active transport Uh, the amino acids that are absorbed uh, by a single or closely related uh, transporters are c o a l cysteine ornithine arginine and lysine now when there is the deficiency or when uh, of this transporter or when there is the uh, uh, when there is a defect in this transporter all these amino acids are not reabsorbed from the renal tubules and in turn they will be excreted in urine so uh, this will be the disease this will be the, uh, result in the manifestation of the disease which is called the cystinuria okay now let's talk about the cystinosis cystinosis you don't have to uh, remember a lot about cystinosis basically the teachers asked uh, asked from you that differentiate between cystinuria and cystinosis the cystinosis is a disease which is caused by the inability of cystine to move out of the lysosomes into the Uh, into this uh, cytoplasm for their uh, metabolism so the cysteine occur, starts accumulating in the lysosomes and it will lead to the formation of cysteine crystals so this will be the disease which is called the cystinuria uh, sorry cystinosis in the next video we will talk about the metabolism of the catecholamine their uh, synthesis their degradation and monoamine uh, monoamine oxygenase inhibitor enzymes okay
थैंक यू वेरी मच